And a lot of kids have imaginary friends. Mm -hmm. uh, Danny certainly did. I think I did. I mean, what makes you suspicious of Sam's? Because Sam said this guy had a line on his face. A line? Like this. Agent Kent. Why haven't you reported in? I've uh, been kind of busy. You were due here yesterday. Yeah, I got bumped from my flight and then, uh, um, uh, you still there? Identify yourself. I just did. Code, please. Code, now, now. Uh, okay, okay. Um, what are you wearing? Okay. Where's Kent? What are you done with him? Answer me, damn it. What the hell happened to Kent? I killed him. It was practice. For when I get my hands on you. I think you're making too much of the line thing. Mm -hmm. I, are you gonna do your show? No, 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 I'm done. Wait, hold on. A line like this? Yep. Oh, come on, it's no big deal. Kids come up with stuff like this all the time. The line could be anything. Or it could be something very specific, and I think we both know what I'm talking about. Todd had a line on his face. A scar. You shouldn't have done that. Kent was one of our best. You're right, I should totally have just let him kill me. Where am I? I'm in this sleepy little town. Really nice community. I, I met this little kid. His name is Sam, and check it out. He's got a sister named Star, and a brother named Jack, and a mother named Blair. And wait, you're never gonna guess what his father's name. Go ahead, guess. Go ahead. You know what? You're never gonna get it. He says his father is named Todd Manning. And I'm like, no way. His father can't be Todd Manning. Because I'm Todd Manning. Is exactly what I thought. Sam traces a line right where Dad used to have a scar that's got to mean no, something, Mom. Really Here's what I think it means. I think that Sam has not seen his father because Todd's been too busy dealing with Jack. So I think it makes complete sense that Sam would come up with an imaginary friend that looks so much like his dad. Except Sam didn't know Todd when he looked like that. Oh, but tell you, that's he's wait, wait, girls. He's seen photos. In fact, I was looking at a photo of Todd and me at our old wedding the other day out by the pool, and that's exactly where you said Sam was talking to his imaginary friend. Right? Yeah, but... Uh... But nothing, sweetheart. It makes sense. 
I bet you Sam has that picture with him right now. So you tell me something. You tell me, who is this guy that's walking around town telling everybody that he's Todd Manning? And how come nobody has figured out that he's a fake? Who says he's a fake? So what does that even mean? I'll tell you everything you want to know. Just come in. No, I come in, you kill me. You're paranoid. No, I'm alive. And I'm going to stay that way. But I want answers. So I'll ask Vicky. Don't involve Todd Manning's family in this. If you do, I can't guarantee their safety. If you hurt them, what I did to Kent, I'll do to you. I promise. seen that picture of course he could have sweetheart and if he is missing dad then it would make sense for him to turn the old version of him into his imaginary friend did you hear that i want you to write that down my daughter just said that i made sense i still think we should talk to sam about this we will sweetheart i don't think there's anything to worry about sam just has a wild imagination and i believe you did too when you were his age you remember the man on the wheel it's a great story <laughs> yeah. apparently you don't remember it as well as I do. What do you mean by that? The man on the wheel was real. Vic. Don't you have people on the payroll to clean up? <laughs> oh, you smashed a picture of the two of us together. What do I do to piss you off this time? Nothing today, yet. But if you had, I don't think I'd be smashing your picture. Yeah, you make me nuts sometimes. But you're my brother. And I will always love you. First, everyone thought I was making up that story about the man on the wheel because I had made up stories before, but that time I wasn't. This thing with Sam could be more than we think. So what are you saying? Sam's imaginary friend is real and has a scar on his face like Todd used to? Really? It's a little out there. Okay, no. You know what? I don't know what I'm saying. I just, I have a bad feeling about this and I'm not going to ignore it. The next time Sam has a discussion with that scar-faced man, I'm going to make sure that I am there to talk to him myself. Why don't you just use this frame but swap this picture out for this one? Man, look at this. So much better looking. <laughs> if you do say so yourself, huh? I like the old face, too. Kidding. No. Oh. So who broke it, anyway? I don't know. No one has owned up to it yet. Did you mean Okinawa dogs? No! I meant origami cogs! They're a real company and they're going after my dad. Why has no one heard about them? This job sucks. I'm out of here. <laughs> 